Hey, what's up guys? Camp and Rusher here. Welcome back everybody to another Fortnite video. It's 2.30 in the morning. Downtime just ended and we've got an update video. It's a big one, of course. We're looking at a new smart build mode. Click one button, do 390s instantly. This might be a little OP. We'll explain it a bit later. Also, refund tokens. Epic has made a huge play. They've got patch notes. We've got a ton of new skins and a bunch more. Stick around. I'm going to talk quick because we've got lots to go through. First, Let's start with these these skins right here. Stream Element skin was revealed earlier, and it's another one of those combo skins. There's over 10,000 unique styles, and uh, I'm showing you a couple of them right now. And then I will also put a, uh, yeah, we can put some some video here as well. Here are all the new customizations in the new, in the new skins. So I got that playing for you as well, so you can see all the different uh, areas, colors you can customize. To, to get to this 10,000 unique styles, right? So that's one of them. Code the camp and rusher if you could. Tossing it in early. Hey, Rush, you can't go two minutes. Can't go one minute without shameless self-promotion. That's okay. I think we also saw a gummy fish stick skin, right? He, he was actually in that video as well. <laughs> it's kind of a random a random one, right? right? Just add to the fish stick collection, though. I, I'm not against it. Still love the skin. I'm not bored of it just yet. And we've got this girl. Well, we'll show all the names at the very end. I don't have the names in front of me right now. Here is the new, here are the new Minty Legends skins. They've redesigned some fan favorites for the, the classic Minty style. I like Minty Bomber. She looks good. And then Oro as well, Minty Oro. Will you be picking that, that pack up? Let me know. Probably a real life money pack, right? Also this skin here, Graven. <laughs> That's a funny one, man. Raven, right? Still, that Raven is such an OG skin. I love that they're still redesigning this. And then here are all the skins with the names. So we got Jet there is the name. We don't know the name of some of them. And I think we were able to go, yeah, Masked Mercenary and Costume Corporal. Those are awesome looking skins, right? I, I, I'm for sure picking those up. Uh, what, are your, what are your favorite? I'm going to go with those ones just because the customization. All right, Shadow Midas also got an update. He now has a gold hand and a dark hand. It, it, it makes him look even better than he already did. Definitely a fan favorite, and I, I don't really hear many who, who, who don't like him, right? He, he's also reactive. He goes from gold to dark based on kills. Gave you a video just for just for some better vi uh, visual, right? So with that being said, we've also got some styles for uh, some of the skins we talked about. Grisabelle, here's some styles in game. Give you an idea. Cool looking skin too, creepy. And then uh, Graveyard, Graveyard Drift. There's going to be multiple styles for this skin as well. This thing is creepy, man. This thing is very creepy. But the stuff we didn't know about the styles. Uh, we'd only seen the one skin when it leaked earlier this week. So that gives us a better look. Definitely picking that one up. It comes with 2,000 V-Bucks as well. So if you're going to buy the V-Bucks anyway, you might as well get a free skin out of it, basically. right? That's how I usually look at it. And then we also, they're so nice to us Epic Games, some free Halloween edit styles. But check this out. The Skull Trooper, gold, gilded it's called. So it's not a fresh skin. I thought they'd sell it as skin, got to be honest with you. But uh, for free. Same with the female version, Skull Ranger. And then we've got Sanctum. Let's go. So, hey, thank you very much, Epic Games. Some free stuff. I'm never complaining. Ex expect those skins to come back in the item shop, though, uh, if you haven't had a chance to pick them up. And I'm sure the gold might convince you. I think the gold looks really good. So, that's all of our skin stuff. Here's some new NPCs, by the way. Zombie NPCs. Uh, just some different colors, different variations. So that's our skins, item shop. Thanks everyone for the support. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Turn those noties on. I'm your guy. I keep you up to date on all things Fortnite. After I'm done this video, edit it, upload it, of course. By the time you're watching it, I am fast asleep. But once I get back up, we'll have another video up uh, covering whatever else we aren't able to cover in this one. Still lost to go though. First, new NPCs. Uh, in 18.2, 18 Dire and Regzy. All right, expect to see them. There will be an upcoming item named, code named, West Sausage. I don't know what it does yet. Take your guesses down below, ladies and gentlemen. What could West Sausage mean? And the Queen set is officially encrypted in the files. 
Hopefully it gets decrypted, man. I want to look at this skin. That's kind of one one of the big questions this season is is how, how does the queen work, right? We know she controls the cubes in some way. She's related to the gold cube specifically, but how, how does it all work? Hopefully we should get some answers by the end of the season. Hopefully right when she arrives um, a, a bit later on. The sideways has been removed from Pleasant Park, Believer Beach, and Weeping Woods. Not sure why, just random update there. And then also with Fort Nightmares, right? This is our first update of Fort Nightmares. Jump scare zombies have been added. They have a 50% 50 spawn chance in their, uh, in their objects. So if you haven't experienced a Fort Nightmares jump scare yet, Turn your volume up <laughs> the next time you play and uh, and just enjoy the ride. Enjoy the ride, ladies and gentlemen. I, I love that. I love they're bringing that back. So uh, updated t t LTMs, Team Brawl. Remember that you earn elim eliminations for your team. Get a random loadout and eliminated players drop a chug splash. I will take a break from late game arena to play that. That's a fun game mode. I like that. And then floor restores as well. All right. They gave us patch notes. They've been hitting us with patch notes lately. Which makes me it makes me a happy man. We actually know everything that's going on first. Uh, of course, we knew this from the previous video. Combat AR versus combat SMG. The vote starts now. Two new weapons, and we only get to see one of them. Uh, yeah, grind your bars out and donate to whatever cause. Donate to whatever weapon you prefer. I'm probably gonna go with the AR just because I don't even really rock an SMG usually. So I'm voting AR. Let me know what you're voting down below. Roll bias and voice chat added to imposters. We knew this was coming. Didn't know it was coming this update though. So yeah, you can now uh, your selected role, your preferred role, and you have a better chance to get it and voice chat. We all know how voice chat works. Also, they have officially, Epic Games has officially noted that the, the game mode is inspired by Among Us from Inner Sloth. So they gave him a shout out. All right, they got a shout out. <laughs> no official collaboration, but uh, at, le at least gave them some credit. Like your squad, stick with them. Starting now in the NA East server region, you can select stay with squad with your fill team and play another match together. Very easy. And then this is a big one. Well, first, actually, the Boundless Set outfits now are back in competitive. They've, they've uh, adjusted them enough that it works with lighting. So welcome back to competitive, but return requests. All right, we gotta go to a separate post for this one. So excited, what a, what a good feature. Basically, every year you are going to get three return requests. So for example, let's say you have three return requests, right? Refund requests, that's what this basically means. If you don't like a skin, uh, you buy a skin within 30 days, you wanna return, refund it, get all your V-Bucks back, then you just, submit a return request. Now, if you have three, you'll use your one, and then 365 days later, you will get that one back. So what an awesome, basically you just get three every year, right? Uh, that, that's how you should look at it. Consumable items such as the battle pass, battle pass levels, or llamas are not returnable, so keep that in mind. Thank you, Epic, what a great feature. Super happy about that, and check this out. So what I was talking about at the start of the video, new smart build mode. I don't think this is out just yet. Uh, we're actually getting another uh, bit of news coming in right now. Sorry, that's why I'm looking at my other screen. But let's finish my thought here. You can see you're basically going to press one button. And so far, these are the only three icons we have. But you can see a full box right away. The one that's huge is the double 90, right? You can make a, a double box super quick. I mean, I know some guys, some pros can do it instantly anyways uh, by tapping like a bunch of buttons at once and standing in a specific spot. But yeah, one button. This is going to make for some interesting fights. I don't know if it's just going to be creative, if they're going to allow it into Battle Royale. It seems a little crazy if they added it to Battle Royale. And that final thing that just came in is this. The grotto, the water level has once again gone down. It's no longer a debate. This is on purpose. It's not a bug. It means something. Get ready. The grotto's coming back in some shape or form, and I can't wait to see what that shape or form is. Thank you for watching. Take care. Touch that like button. Subscribe. Talk care. Take, take care. Talk soon. Goodbye.